Welcome to a brand new episode of Timmy Talks, the channel where we talk old school magic. But today we're going to play old school Chandelar. I finally got it to work on my laptop. I'm very excited about this. Haven't played the game in ages. Uh, in case you don't know what it is, a really quick explanation. It's the first Magic the Gathering electronic game. It's an RPG. It's flaky for sure. Uh, we're going to play it today. I think it's the best electronic Magic the Gathering game ever, ever, period. But then again, I'm an old man, you know, I, I play old school and stuff, so I like this stuff. Anyway, uh, we're going to go in, start a new game. I think I'm going to go with Sorcerer. You know, not the hardest yet. Um, I got to do blue, right? I got to do blue. I got to collect the Tims. I want to make a Timmy deck, I think. Let's go for it. Um, let's be a wizard. What can we wear? All these options. They all look ridiculous. To be honest, um, what I'm gonna do, let me go, bum ba bum ba bum yeah, pretty happy with this. I don't remember to have all this, that the game had all this variety, like back in the day. Ooh, I can even hold a snake, look at that. I'm gonna go for this one, this this looks more experimental. Um, and I got an axe in my hand, can I change that somewhere? I'll make it to this, like this magical, magical sword. And then... I guess the wizard always has an eye patch, which is funny. I kind of like it, you know, it, it fits the Timmy Talks theme with the pirate ship, so I'm gonna go for it. Anyway, save it here. Oh, I guess I don't save it here. I'm gonna leave, enter my name. Well, obviously it's Tim B. Enchanter. Who else would I be? And let's go. Ooh, materializing. Wow, this takes me back. This takes me back. Okay, first things first, I want to go and check my deck, right? Do the volume down a little bit. Let's have a look. What do I have? Okay, so I've got black. I've got 46 cards. I've got 19 mana. That's not too shabby. I've got the right colored mana, which is nice. Um... So I can dump a few cards, make it into a 40 card deck. So that's what I think I'm gonna do. Throne of Bones is gonna go out. Leviathan, unfortunately, because I mean, I'm never gonna cast it. I'm not gonna sell it though. I'm gonna, I'm, it's gonna come back later. Don't don't worry, don't worry. Um, I got a Control Magic. Wow, that is really, this is actually a pretty decent deck. I get a Sari Angel, Semite Healers. This is pretty decent. Um, Sea Serpent Sideboard because of the Island Home. I got a Mamoti Jin, Papa Moti, wow. I wish I would have had these cards like back in the day. Okay, and I'm gonna go down to 16 mana. No, that's not smart. That is not smart. Um I guess I could take out Cursed Wreck. Take out Pit Scorpion, and I've got 40 cards, which I think is the minimum. See if I can buy some cards. I'll buy the Kithkin. Ooh, the Pestilence is really good. Another Swamp. You know what? I could go for Blue Black. I could go for Blue. That's pretty cool. Um, let's begin a quest, shall we? Take a green creature spell to the Keeper of Elrond Hole. A Mana Link and... Oh, Ma Mana Link is like life. The more Mana Link you have, the more life you start with. So to get a Mana Link this early in the game, Super. Um, accept the quest. So we'll go to Eleanor Hole. So I'm gonna go on the map. Okay, that's pretty close. Leave is a village. There we go, people. Eleanor Hole. Ooh, let's get some treasure. Finding a swamp, decent. You happen upon a. Okay, I wasn't quite sure, but these are clues for a dungeon, I think. Cool, cool, cool. Let's continue. Find a green creature spell. Oh, that's what I have to do. I thought I just had to walk to the hole. Uh-oh. Find a green creature spell. Okay. So 
bit more complex. Okay, got a planes. Oh, I gotta fight. Well, I can win a green creature spell. Does that count? Okay, Druid will play first. Oh, so many lands. Look at my hand. Semite Healer, Sephir Velcon. Starting with the Wooden Sphere. Okay, but I can cast a Plains and hopefully next turn I can play an Island, play the Falcon. I'm feeling good. I mean, this is this is working. I just have way too too many lands in my hand. That's the, that's the thing. Okay, Sephir Falcon. So one one flyer doesn't have to tap when attacking. AKA Vigilance in the modern terms. Another Wooden Sphere. Okay, Wooden Sphere number two. I don't recognize all the artwork. Oh, look at that, I got a Timmy. Wait, first we're gonna attack. That's how we roll. Play it second main. No, whoa! So this is what happens a lot when I used to play, and I guess it still happens when I'm playing Chandelar. I click too quickly and then I kind of skip a face. Oh, giant spider, that is bad news. That is really bad, but I've got a Mamoti Jin, so hopefully in a couple of turns I'll be able to cast the Mamoti. This is bad. It's gonna attack me with the spider. Okay, Lay Druid. Lay Druid is pretty good. You know, Lay Druid combine it with, you know, Maze, Slide Rip Alexandria. It's really sweet. I also like the art. No, no fast effects yet. Cursed land. Ooh, that's pretty good. Um, five mana at the moment, so next turn I can play my Mamoti. I guess I can attack because these spiders tapped. Put them on seven. Mm, you know what? I'm going to kill the late Druid main because... Oh, wait. It's not picking it up properly. There we go. Because, you know, if he gets to go to his own turn, to the main phase with the Lay Druid, he can untap a land and he'll have like five or six mana. No, I'm not gonna uh, block the spider. More damage, dropping to six. Oh, killer bees. That is a problem. Luckily for me, he's gaining a life. So I can kill it with the Tim. I'm gonna do that straight away. Go for Swamp. Ooh, Mahamoti, Papamoti. Okay, first gonna attack. Am I gonna attack with this? No, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna use my Samite Healer to prevent damage next turn. Okay, gonna play Mahamoti. Papamoti, Papamoti. Ah, this is really good. Got this in the bag. Ooh, that's a good card. Iron Root Tree Folk, 3-5, but it doesn't fly, so that's fine. And look at that, right? He kept his giant spider untapped. It's not going to help him, though. Attacking with the Modi. And then I've got some options, right? I can play a Sarah Angel or a Cursed Land. I'm going to play the Cursed Land, so he takes the damage, goes to 1. And then I can ping him to death with the Tim. That's the game plan. Gonna pass the turn. Gonna take the damage. And I'm gonna ping the Druids. Winning. Haha, <laughs> this is good. Look at that, oh no, I thought I won. Look Look what he does, Giant Grove, or she does. Giant Grove, Wooden Sphere activation, double. Oh, this is so bad. Am, am I dying now? I thought I won the game. Oh no, I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose, oh. I should have pinged before combat. Oh, this is so bad. So this is me and Chandelar in a nutshell. I mean, <laughs> this is so bad.
It happens though. I'm, you know, I made a promise with myself and also with you guys. When I'm playing this, I'm not gonna, you know, you know, quit and then start again. And no, 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 no. Whatever I do, I do. What happens in here, happens here. You know, I'm not gonna try to uh, wiggle my way out of it. Uh, I'm gonna add the Amru Kithkin, so I'm back to 40 cards again. Oh, wait a minute. I think I'm gonna drop a swamp. I'm gonna add a plains. I'm gonna leave the village. Let's, no, I wanna fight the druid again. Duel the druid. Okay, I can win a crawl worm. I wanna win a crawl worm. That's a cool card. I learned my lesson. I learned my lesson. Plains. No, no, no. Island. I really need to take my time here. Murfolk of the Pearl Trident. Next turn I can play a Samite Healer. I'm a little bit low on Lance in this hand, so that's not ideal. Okay. I'm gonna attack. Let's see if he wants to trade. Okay. Fair enough. I don't mind. 1-1 one, one Vanilla for an Asp. I think that's a good deal. I can't believe I just lost that match. I was win if, if I just pinged before combat, I would have won. Mm. Ooh, unstable mutation. Yes, please. My opponent only has eight, so go for it. Down to four. She's probably gonna gain some life. That's what the druid does. Of course. Let's attack. Still a 3-3. Okay, he's gonna block. That's good. Hmm, my healer is gonna die soon though, and I really, really, really need some more lands. Like I can play the protocol. Oh no. Okay, there's a the planes. That's good news. Let's attack, see what she's gonna do. I mean, she's losing all these um, killer bees. I don't mind. I've killed two killer bees with a Samite healer. That's, that's good. Mm. Lunarel, gain some more life, blah, blah, blah. That's a problem, you know, those wooden spheres. Whoever plays those cards, I love it. I love that about Chandler. I really, really do. Um. You know what, I'm just gonna ping main just straight because I can wait for the perfect moment to ping, but I'm just gonna forget, so I'm just gonna do it now. Um, okay, so my Samite's a 1-1. One, one. Go, Samite Healer! Play my Kithkin. It's kind of a forgotten combo here. Particle Sorcerer, Amru Kithkin, kind of. You know, you ping away the smaller creatures and then the bigger creatures cannot block the Kithkin. I'm just gonna take the damage here, drop to nine. Ooh, Dirtwood Boars, that is really good. Okay, so my healer is gonna die, because I gotta activate it. Hmm, Dirtwood Boars is a problem. Ooh, now I can play Wall of Air. What shall I do? Like, I can go Wall of Air or Phantom Monster. It's risky though, because she is playing with giant growths. So I'm just gonna go wall of air. I'm gonna go a bit. After the last game, I'm gonna go for safe. I'm gonna attack with the Kithkin. And I'm gonna kill the Lana Remain. So she doesn't have the mana in her own turn. Yeah, it's gonna. Oh, what? Why didn't I block? Why? I you have to understand. I haven't played this game in ages. Okay. Uh, giant spider. No. If I'm gonna lose this again, I'm gonna go crazy. Um, forgetting to ping as well. By the way, I'm playing so bad. I'm playing so bad. Okay, focus. I'm gonna focus. Okay. 
Of course, crawl worm. Yeah. Things keep getting worse for me. Um, I'm gonna think. I think I can. W no, I cannot win because he's gonna block. Thomas is want. <sighs> Why am I so bad at this game? Why? I'm gonna attack with the Phantom. I could also attack with the Kithkin. Nobody's gonna kill me on a crackback. Okay, attack with this. Let's see what. What does she do? She doesn't block at all, okay. That's problematic, I guess. So I gotta go and chump block next turn. I actually could have won already. Look, I've got enough mana. I could have made my Emru Kithkin unblockable. Put him on a one, play the Sorcerer Killer, and she's also tapped out. Oh, man. Never mind. Never mind. Let's hope that she's going to give me one more turn. Look at this. Instill energy and gaining life and attacking. Uh, what do I have to do here? Um, assign attackers. No, I've got no fast effects. Choose blockers. Okay, Wall of Air is going to go on the Dorkwood. Emru Kithkin has to jump. And that's it. Discard face fast effect. Going to ping the Druid. Okay, now I really, oh, of course, she can survive because of that giant spider with the insult energy. Oh, I think I'm going to lose this one. I can attack with the phantom. Okay, I guess I, I should attack with the phantom. Nah, should I attack with the phantom? Oh, I guess I shouldn't. If I attack, it's going to block on Giant Spider. I can kill with the Sorcerer, but I'm on three. No, I shouldn't attack. Oh, man. I think I'm going to lose. And rightfully so, because I made so many mistakes. But maybe, maybe, maybe. Fingers crossed. Oh, he didn't attack. She didn't attack. I forgot to ping. I'm so bad, so bad at this. Okay, okay, focus, focus, focus. Don't attack me. And then I got a ping in her end step. Don't attack, don't attack, don't attack, don't attack. Good. Timmy, go down to one. I think I got this. Timmy. Hey, finally! Woohoo! My first win! Take the cards! Take the cards. So I got a mana link and I got an amulet. Sweet. And I'm not gonna defeat the paladin yet. Gotta love the music. Uh, I'm gonna sell the crawl one. I think Cursed Wreck could still be useful. Um, sell the, no, I don't want to sell the Pit Scorpion. You can make like a Poison deck. I guess I should play the Pestilence, but they only have four Swamps though. I need to get some Swamps. Divine Transformation is pretty good. I only have 35 though. Food. Okay, let's do a little bit of shopping. Let's see if I can find something. I can win a mana crypt. Oh yeah, I'm gonna duel the creature. No! This have there's some glitches where you click on I wanna duel and then yeah, it kicks you out. I have no idea where I am. I don't okay. No 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 no, I don't wanna fight the dragon. Good. Defeat the clerk, and I'll reward you with a green amulet. Oh, so many enemies. 
Um, white? Do I need that? Oh, wait, look how much money I have. I guess I found, when I was on a glitchy thing, I guess I found a lot of money. Good, I'm gonna buy these COPs. They're good for in the dungeon. Nice, I've got a lot of money. That helps. Change the village. Forest? Cormus Bell, that's a cool card. I'm gonna buy the Cormus Bell. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but... Trade green amulets for colorless cards. Okay. Mm. Lands. Yeah, there are lands I want to buy. City of Brass. Two green amulets. Mishra's Factory, maybe? All these lands are like multiple green amulets. They only have one. I guess I gotta go for the commons. Cursed Rex tap is even tablet and fear hurts his chalice. Hmm. It's probably better to just kind of keep my one tablet for now. Defeat the seer, which has been menacing our village. I'll reward with colorless cards. Yes. Okay. The seer is tough, but I think I can do it. Oh, this is the witch. I thought she was the seer. Um, sure, I'm gonna duel. Why not? Gotta take a mulligan. Like, if you have no lands, you can take a mulligan, which is nice. Okay, this is better. Done. Um, Phantom Monster Control Magic Amru Kithkin. So I guess I want to play Planes. And maybe if I draw into another Planes, I can play the Kithkin next turn. There's a Swamp, a Willow. Okay, pretty good. Everybody used to play Willow back in the day. No second Swamp, so just a pass. There we go. Oh yeah, this is this is old school. Unholy strength on a willow, so you have a two-two regenerator turn two. That was that's really good. What's really sweet is dark ritual into black knight with unholy strength. We've got like a four-three first strike. Mm. I got control magic though, so I'm hopeful. <coughs> But this is problematic. Like, I'm, I'm dropping to seven. I need an island so I can play a control magic. There we go. Island. I could also play Phantom Monster because I can block. I can use the Phantom to block the Willow. So then hopefully the witch is not going to attack with the Willow and then I can steal it and I've got an uh, untapped creature. Wall of Bone, that's good. Yeah, I think my strategy for this game is definitely going to be through the air. Stealing it, stealing the Willow, attacking here. She's on five, that's good. Ah, oh, that's good at Drain Life. That is decent. I'm going to play an unstable on my phantom. I mean, that's six damage. That's huge. There we go. Okay, on one. Second main. Um, I guess I should play the wand. And then next turn I can make my Kithkin unblockable. In case, like, maybe she plays like a terror on the phantom or something. Or drain life. Uh, I'm going to take the damage. Gonna win it here, yeah. Ooh, Neverworld Disc, right? That is a problem. I guess I gotta click on the unstable. Boop. Okay, 
Okay, so we're in my main, so I'm going to use the want. Making my Kithkin unblockable, and then I'm going to attack. Here we go. Yay, victory. And a, cur and a second curse land. That's actually good. I'm going to take the cards. It's going to make a curse land deck. Got to defeat a seer. Is this a seer? It is. Okay, cool beans. Uh, ghost, I want to win a ghost ship. Give me the ghost ship, please. I'm a big fan of ghost ship. Big fan. That four toughness is really good. And that regeneration, it comes in handy more often than you think. Oh, uh, my hand. Mm. Okay, I, I can play a drudge turn two, which is not too shabby. Maybe I should have gone for wizard level. Although I've made so many mistakes that maybe, maybe sorcerer is my level. And it fits with the Tim, right? Prodigal Sorcerer, Sorcerer level, so it's kind of fun. Let me know, by the way, in the comments if you enjoy this, and I'll, I'll make some more episodes. I mean, I know there's already a lot of, like, Chandelier stuff out there, which is quite good. Um, let's see, what do I have? A Drudge, he's got an Ornithopter, a Zephyr. Yeah, it makes no sense to attack. Oh, this is bad, unstable. This is bad. Okay, island. I can steal again. I'm gonna steal. Control magic is so good. Oh no, counterspell. This is the, the, the mirage art, I think, of counterspell. Wow, a counterspell. Oh man. No. Okay, uh, I, for a moment I thought she was playing another unstable, but it's just one unstable. Dropping to four, so it's going to be two, dropping to two. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, I love this combo, Time Elemental, with the uh, unstable mutation set for Falcon. I love that. I wonder if she's going to uh, do the unstable back or the set for Falcon. Uh, I'm going to play the water elemental, see if I can put some pressure on maybe. You know, attack with the water elemental. Um, done. I'm gonna drop to two. Oh, man. I need a miracle. Miracle, miracle. Ghost ship? I mean, I think that's at least something. A little bit afraid though, because we still have that time elemental, so I don't think she can unless she's got another unstable. Can she win it now? Attacking here. Interesting. So I'm not using the time elemental to save the set for your order unstable. Okay, so I'm lucky here. She's making a few mistakes. Um but I have to get rid of that. Time elemental. This this could take a while, this game. <laughs> I mean, with that time elemental on the board, she says, whoop, 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 whoop. Exactly, sending my ship back again. I'm just gonna keep playing the ship. You know what, I'm gonna attack. Let's see, let's, let's see if she blocks. Maybe she's just gonna take the damage. No. Sometimes these they make these mistakes, right? Where they do kind of goofy things. Oh, this is so frustrating. Time elemental, such an annoying card. What if what if I'm just gonna play out something else? Maybe then she also does something else. You know what I mean? Just by going for the moti. I just need a way to get rid of the time elemental, but I don't think I have any creature removal in my deck. I got one Tim, but that's not enough because time elemental is too toughness. Oh no. Now at least I can play two things. 
she can only ping one thing. I'm gonna attack with the Drudge to kind of offer a trade for the Sephir. Ooh, wow, this is a surprise. This is a surprise. I didn't expect her to do this. I thought she was going to send Goshi back, attack with the Sephir. This is this is a nice combo. Time element to Tetravis, right? She can take the tokens off, send the Tetravis back to her hand, next turn play it out again. This is really sweet. So much inspiration for forgotten combos. Um, ooh, this is interesting. I could go unstable on the ghost ship. Attack for five. I'm just so low. I'm so low. Uh, I guess I got what, what to do. Let's play. Just do something silly. I'm going to play a brainwash on Tetris. And I'm going to play. I guess I got enough mana for it. So I'm just going to play out the mana mode. Uh, that's it. I'm not going to attack. So Brainwash is a card from the dark. Nobody plays the Enchant Creature for one white. Let me show it here on the screen. And um, when they attack, they have to pay three mana. That's it. I mean, it would have been a little bit better if it said, you know, block or attack, you got to pay three. Ooh, this is really good. No, an unsummon. Let's see, what can I do? I can play a Tundra Wolves. Play my Modi again. That's it, basically. Kind of a standstill. The problem, though, is that I'm on two and she's on eight. So I'm not really happy with this. But she's playing Mono Blue. So there's not really direct damage in there. Well, there's Psionic Blast, Side Blast. Oh, yeah, this is annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. So I don't have enough mana to do like two things. Mm. Like if I have eight, I can play Scavenger Ghoul and Phantom Monster in one go. It is interesting to see, by the way, that she's not at all using the Tetravis. Uh, Time elemental combo. Oh, curse land. That's actually not too shabby. But I just don't have enough mana to do two things, do I? Whatever, I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna play Phantom. What I mean, if she attacks with Tetravis, I can use my semi healer block on the ghost ship. I can do that, that works. I wonder if she's gonna use the time elemental for the curse land. The funny thing is if she does, because uh okay, no, she's using it on the ship. Okay, never mind. Another planes, that's good news, you know. Like, the more mana, it means I can do two things instead of one. Uh, scavenging ghoul. Don't want to attack, nope. Okay, Curse Land does damage during the upkeep, so even if he now uses the time element or she, uh, she's still going to take a damage. Sending back the ship. You know, I'm not unhappy how this is going. Only problem here is that I'm on two, so I'm still very vulnerable. I can still play the gin. I've got so much mana. Okay. Go for it. And now, at a certain point, I can... Maybe start attacking. Ooh, Crystal Rod. That's annoying. Yep, sending that back. Okay. 
This could be a big turn. I got to think for a moment because I've got three flyers. He's got two blockers. Um, what I could do is play unstable on the phantom and just attack. Or I could play it on the ship because if I play it on the ship, I think then she doesn't have enough mana. It's risky because I'm on two, so, but I'm gonna do it. Look at that, I'm gonna kill her ship. That's ideal. Uh, curse land. Could play, oh, could have played a water elemental, I think. Or not. No, I didn't have enough mana. Okay, she's dropping to five. It's looking good, it's looking good. Um, or is the program going to crash right now? This is always a bit risky. Oh, trike! Oh, that's so good. No! No, 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 no. Oh, no. Where did this Triskelion come from? I was, I was really grinding this match. I was winning this match. Okay. Whatever. Oh, man. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna save for now. Let's go. Tim the Enchanter. And I'm gonna quit for now. Thank you guys for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, leave a comment down below and I'll make some more for you guys. I'm definitely gonna play more uh, in this game, so probably I'm just gonna, gonna make some more episodes anyway. But, oh, this is so much fun. Anyway, see you guys next time.